Next. So tell us about yourself. My name is Jack and I am an addict, but I recently quit. How long have you been sober for? I've been sober for about 48 hours. How would you describe the past 48 hours? The past 48 hours have been terrible. I've been experiencing withdrawals. Emotionally, I'm on a roller coaster. I'm, I'm going up and down physically. What, what withdrawals have you been experiencing? Some slight shape, shaking, um, and some tiredness. What exactly are you addicted to? Um, I'm addicted to lava cakes. Can you elaborate more on what you've been going through? I, I feel like I'm trapped inside my body. I've been hearing things. I hear the doorbell ring. And I, I, I can't get out of my head. It's, the addiction is taking over me. What's been your biggest challenge staying sober? My biggest challenge would have to be the hallucinations. It's like they're everywhere I go. I see them. Next to each other. Thinking out and sitting on each other's lap. It was so weird and disgusting. Jack. Jack. Are, help, are you even listening? They're calling my name. They want, they want me. It's, it's taking over. It's taking over my life. It's taking over my social life. How it's, are your friends and family dealing with that? I mean, they're helping, but they're not helping enough. I still see them. I still see the hallucinations. I'm over it. I'm so done. Done. And I, I hear things, and I want them, and my friends don't understand that. Jack, come on, we're going. No, I'm not moving until they're here. You can't make me come out. I'm not. Why do you, Why do you think you're addicted? They're, they're always there, and they're always there for they're, me. They're inanimate the objects. No, they're here, and I need them. And they taught me, and I want them, and I need them yeah, now. They are not They're here always for you. there. We They're always there. there. Who likes They're always there. How did you get them? We need them. Put them down. Do not them. have been sober for 48 hours. Yeah, I'm not a good girl.